Yeah, no, I got my bases. I have two layers, like two base layers of, of a wall. I have a door, and then I have like five things of storage. That's pretty much it. Oh, Oh yeah, that's gonna be fun going in there and killing them. That's a level five. There, there must be some pretty good loot in there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We gotta just um build blocks too, so we can like if we build high enough away from them, that'd be fun. See, I've played survival games, so I wasn't sure if you were able to like build like a little like stairway type thing and then just sit there and kind of head them. You can, but they can break it. Mm. So. That's the thing about those infestors is, is whether it's daytime or not, oh, they can run. No, I didn't. They're all like piling up somewhere inside. I'm, there's no way I can get my stuff. Yeah, they're all chasing me. All right, whatever. Oh, damn it. I'm only gonna use my ammo on these infested. Like oh. I got one of the infested by himself. And try to get them. Oh, sh dude. Oh, that wasn't even reloaded. Damn it. I know I hate the pipe shock, and it takes so long to reload. It's gonna be the best shotgun you have for a while though. They're like really hard to find new shotguns, better ones. Well, the uh. No, I'm outside. I'm so I just want to get rid of the. I mean, I can kind of chase these guys away. Oh fuck! I missed my shot. Damn it. I see. I see you. Yeah, I'm gonna just float around this area on the outside till I can kill these guys. Zombie. Damn, these army guys are pretty tough too. Yeah, dude, there's certain zombies that are just tougher. At least he can't run though. Got him. Oh, dude, I have no stamina. I'm cooked. I, I have to re. Infested zombies on me. I got ammo. I got ammo for a seven six two, but I don't have a gun for it. Oh, damn, he just smoked me one hit. I'm not gonna lie, dude, we might just, let's, we should mark this place on the map and then come back to it, because we're, we're, there's no way that we're gonna be able to survive. 
All right. Uh, Sounds good. I, 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 I just want to grab my... I want to grab my stuff. Real quick. All these zombies are on the outside. Fuck. We don't have to um, go back to your base, but I want to go to the trader to do some quests. Now, like if other people join, do they have do they automatically get the same trader that I do? Yeah, because there's multiple traders in the game. So they there's do. There's one um, in the dead forest. There's one in the pine forest. So they do get the same trader as me. Yeah, but you gotta. Um, I'm pretty sure in order to um, get coordinates to the. Oh no 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 no. no. To get coordinates to one person, the other trader in the dead forest, you have to do like all a ton of quests. So I have level three quests, but I only have two traders, so I don't know how to get access. I think I just gotta do more and more. Alright, well, fuck it. Uh, what is this? How do you mark stuff up on the map? Um, so go to the map thing in your icon and then click on where you want to mark and then you just say quick waypoint. See how I marked it? Can you see that? Oh yeah, quick waypoint. I can't see your mark, but I can see mine. Alright, okay. that's mine then. Yeah, I do want to come back here. Uh, damn, fuck. Is your base near the trader? Yeah. Yeah. Um. That's all right. Fuck it. Come on. It is what it is. I'll sign something. No, I just got a lot of stuff. I know what I need to do. I need to build the base up, have like a bunch of supplies there that I don't care that gets stolen, and then I need to hide like a, a couple crates like outside my base somewhere. Yeah, what I have a um, um, I don't. No one's ever joined my server, even though I made it public. But I'm, I'm kind of glad because it would get there's hella stuff that would get raided. But I dug a trench. So you know every seven days there's like a blood moon type thing? I've seen- I seen that in the settings before I started it. They said there was a care package drop on day three and then the blood moon. I'm not- it's, it's day three right now, so I haven't seen the care package and I haven't so seen the blood moon. Do you know those like infested zombies? It's like they spawn in at like a thousand rates and there's a ton of them. All, no matter where you are, all of you. So what I did, it took me to day 21 to actually like survive one. Well, I actually didn't survive. I, I was so close to living, but then I, uh, I ran out of ammo. Oh wow, this is a nice base. This is way better than mine. Sweet. I'm gonna. Oh, trader rack doesn't open for a second, so. Wait, we can just chill. So yeah, I try to have stuff organized. It's not completely organized yet, because I, like I said, I just started, but I kind of got things a little organized. Here, do you mind if I, uh, wait? Do you have any glue? Uh, I think I have one glue. Can I take, um, your short iron pipe? How much of it do I have? You have five. Can I take all of it? But it'll benefit you. Yeah, go ahead. All right, now I just need glue. How many glue do you need? I only have one. I have, I need four. Well, there's one in this in this last one right here on the right. There's glue in there. Okay. Here, I'm gonna drop a rep my repair kit in yours. Okay, so. What's this land claim block? 
Oh, that's like the land claim block is that once you, if you build it, you could set your base, like that's how you start your base. So you could put your base like next to mine or wherever you want on the map. So that gives, the land claim gives you a perimeter of where you can build and shit. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> I'm gonna need a four glue in that one. Yeah, I don't know what to tell. Uh, there's another glue in here. There's one more on this one that I'm standing on. All right, all right. Here, let me make you a. Uh... All right, here you go. That's what you. It's a pipe rifle. It's what you use for your seven six two ammo. Oh, sweet! Thank you. Yeah. And you use short pipes to repair them. Is it good? I've never used it. Like, is it better than the shotgun? Yeah, yeah I would say it is. Aim for the head. Okay. The pipe shotgun is probably the worst gun that you could have. So, well then, since you did that, here, take this. Oh, wait, I didn't even drop it, did I? Nope, here. Oh, thanks. I appreciate that, thanks. Me too. The reason the pipe shotgun's not great is because it takes so long to reload for, the, for how little damage it does. Right. Other than that, I'll make you a pipe pistol and then we can do some quests for, um... Oh... I don't know how quests... Are. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, I, I could have made it. I see. I'm looking at it right now. Like, if I was to craft it, I have a level 2 shotgun, level 2 pipe rifle, level 3 pipe pistol, level 2 pipe oh, machine gun. Here, I'm gonna put all of your, all of your uh, stuff then back in the thing. You want uh, your shotgun back or no? Nah, you can keep that. I don't know if we can do quests together, like if we can sign up for the same one, or if you do want to sign stuff for both of them. I don't, I don't know. There is, um, I mean, since you're here, you can help me. There, there is a thing I was raiding over here. We can definitely do this. It had really good loot in it. I just didn't finish it. And then you joined, so I went over there. Look out, look out, look out. Damn, why are there so many? Holy shit. I'm so oh no, there's a big I'm guy. Dude. He's an infected toe. If you can just swarm him, I can just keep shooting him. I got 58 bullets in this pipe rifle. Yeah, I got you. Oh. Not sure how accurate if I'm even hitting. I'm aiming right at him. Yeah, um, it's because, uh, you need to update your perk points. Sometimes the bullet's just gonna. Oh, look, you got one coming out behind you on the ground. Oh, thank you. Yeah, sometimes the gun's just gonna deliberately miss. You just need to update your uh, setting. They're not setting, though, your perk points. You put your perk points in here. But uh, you need a lot of XP. Oh, shoot. So are they like regaining health when they're eating you after they kill you? I don't think so. I think that's just like a part of the game. Oh damn, they just smoked me too. By yourself, when you die, they all go okay. 
Yeah, when I went to a base, I noticed that, like, if I killed them and I, like, I died and I killed them, they wouldn't come back. But if I did, like, half damage to them and then I died and I came back, it was almost like they, like, they respawned with full health. Yeah. Oh shit, they all swarmed around you, which sucks, but now uh, I can get away. But if you want me to uh, bring them back over to me, I can. That's fine. I, I made it to where if we die, we keep what's in our, like, our, our bar. Yeah, but the, our, our backpack we dropped. So I didn't, I didn't want to make it too easy, but I wanted to make it somewhat difficult, you know what I mean? Yeah, that's fair. Oh shit, I just fell into a tunnel. Oh, there we go. Uh, we can. Don't some of these guys drop like backpacks and shit, don't they? Yeah, but they're rare. You need to just update your. Uh, it, it's really confusing because the first one tells you how much you discovered of that. Yeah, I'm like level five, I think. I've done a couple perk points. Yeah, I would put it on the lucky leader. You think that's the best? Yeah, because it, it drops the backpack one off, and I'm pretty sure, and you, uh, it's just better. And then you get better, uh, stuff from it. Uh, okay. Damn, I got a broken bone. I might, I might just try to fight these guys off, and if they kill me, they kill me, and I'll spawn back at least without a broken bone. I'd rather not wait ten minutes. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna be inside your base, and then we can, um, I swear it won't take anything. All right, you're good. I'm gonna stand on top of the RC, and then we can leave with him forever. Feel about this fat guy here. Yeah. I think I got him. Yep. All right, I'm gonna let this one kill me so I can spawn back in with, with no damage. Gotcha. Thought it was funny how they give me achievements for dying. I got an achievement for dying seven times. And I got an achievement for dying 14 times. Oh, wait, what, what? Oh, she, like, glitched into the ground. I don't know if you can see this. I'm coming. Oh, she came back up. Wait. It's weird. She's, like, glitching in my screen. But, yeah, nah. This game does seem like if you had, like, 
like w at least one other like loyal player. This shit seems like it'd be mad fun to play. But I haven't been able to find anyone like ever with a mic at all. So I, I mean, I don't play. I used to play more often. But back when school wasn't like as often. I mean, shit, you got me. I'll play. I, I work. Uh, usually work Monday through Friday. I mean, it's Monday through Saturday, but it's been Friday because the season's slowing down. Yeah. But I'm usually. Work. I install football fields. Oh shit. Really? Yeah, I, I work for. I'm in the union. I'm in the carpenters' yeah, union. I install turf. Sweet, yeah, it is sweet. It's good money. Break your back. Make yeah. make like 26 an hour, and then anything after eight is like 38. And then if I work Saturdays, it's all time and a half the whole time. And Sundays, if I work Sundays, it's double. Dude, that's the dream for me. Um, I work. At, wait, what state are you in? I'm in New York. Alright, so you probably don't know, but I work at this grocery store called The Pig, and it pays like 8 bucks an hour, and dude, after every day, my back hurts so bad. Sounds like something in Pennsylvania. It's in Wisconsin. <clears throat> I've been yeah. through there. I've driven from New York to Vegas. I've been through there, but I don't really remember. It was all just flat land. I think, I think that's where it was. Um, I get paid eight bucks, and on Sundays I get paid an extra dollar. But like, I don't really get shifted too often. Well, like I get shifted. Um, this is that. Fridays, Saturdays, or Sundays, but it varies, you know. Yeah, that's terrible. Eight bucks an hour, bro. Like, I would never work for that. Yeah, no, it's really shitty. And I'm 15, so I could be doing like so much better stuff. Oh, you're only 15. Damn. Okay. Yeah. See, I'm 26, so there's that's, there's a difference. <laughs> right. When you get a little older, you'll be able to... For 15, though, at least you're making something. That's not bad. For for being 15 and putting money in your pocket, that's all bad. That's what, my, yeah, that's what my dad says. I got, like, no overhead costs, so I'm chilling. Right. And once you turn, like, 16, 17, even 18, you'll have a lot better jobs open up to you. Your main thing, your main focus right now should be just be getting a car. Once you get a car, that just it, it, you're free once you get a car. Right. My, Yeah, everyone that's, if you're 16, you get paid, like, starting nine bucks at, at, at least. So they only let you work, like, a certain amount of hours a week, right? Well, I don't know. I mean, they don't shift me for too long. I mean, I think I can work up to, like, eight hours a day. Or maybe seven, I think it is. Oh, I would take these oil shares. Okay, um... Well, I don't know, it's just the berries. It's like a weekly thing, you know, you know every week what your schedule is for the coming week. It's not really too... I mean, it's very flexible, but it's not, uh, I don't know. It's like the hours of the day change, like you shifted, so... Mm. Yeah. yeah, I see. Nah, uh... In New York, when you're, f like, I think 14 and 15, like, you can only work, like... I think it's like 15 hours a week max. It's something stupid like that. I don't know. I've, um, I know this week, or last week, I worked like 11 hours, but I don't I mean, after taxes, it's probably like gonna bring in like 80 bucks, but fuck it, that's a new game you know, or something. I, I think, yeah, I barely get anything. Like, I get paid like maybe 35 bucks a week, which sucks because I feel like I'm working like. Oh, eight hours maybe a week <laughs> that's fucking terrible but i mean for like i said it's it's a little cash in your pocket so yeah and they did set up a bank account and a debit card for me without having me having to do anything with the credit card. oh that's pretty cool yeah because usually you have yeah, to pay for easy. that it's direct deposit to my account so it's like that's pretty sweet. So you're in what? You're probably in like what? Tenth grade? Yeah, I'm a sophomore. Now. Was there? Do you live in? Do you live in like the city, or is it like mainly like? Is it like outskirts? Like, is there very? Is it very rural? Like your neighbors like ten miles away? No, no. I I go to school in Milwaukee, but I live like forty minutes away. So you live like forty minutes outside the city. No, I mean, it's, it's, 
there is farmland around us, but we live in like a neighborhood with an HOA and stuff. It's it's not uh, it's it, you know we get deer out here and turkeys, but it's not like a crazy deer five miles away from each other. But like in Milwaukee, you know what you know what Milwaukee is, right? Or like what Milwaukee is. I've heard of it. I couldn't. I, if you showed me the map, I couldn't point it where it was at. <laughs> yeah, no, it's a hood as hell, bro. It's. I mean, I go to a private school, so that's why it kind of evens out. Otherwise, I'm not mess with that area. Like that. So, what do your parents do? Are they like farmers or something? No, my dad. Uh, my mom used to be a teacher, and my dad he does insurance now, but my mom doesn't really have to work anymore. That's good. Never. You got a girlfriend or anything? As of now, no. I, I work too much, bro. Yeah, that's fair. Yo, there's like a bomb oh. connected to this. Yeah. <laughs> what oh. the fuck? I've never seen this before. Oh shit! <laughs> <laughs> Yo, that was great. Oh my god. Dude, I've never seen that before and I've played like. Dude, I've never seen that before. That's hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's mad funny. What, what were you gonna ask, all? Um. Are you doing any like um, like do you go to the gym at all or anything like that? Uh, I honestly I don't have time to. I I literally work so much. It's it's. <laughs> I work I work about. 60, 70 hours a week. That's insane, dude. But at least it's, uh... You know, it's your... Oh, did you die too? Oh, yeah, I just died right there. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna make sure to not touch you. Oh, I can't even get in because of that guy. Oh, wait. Yeah, it's pretty decent, though. Before taxes, like, I'll bring home, like... Not bring home, but... I'll make, like, two grand a week. Yeah, but keyword is before taxes. Yeah, well, after tax, they take like one third of my check every week. It sucks, but once tax time hits, they're gonna they're gonna give me like three, four grand. So, and I get a bonus at the end of the year, which is like three, four grand. So, dude, that's sweet. And then I get I get three months off of the year. So I work nine months, and then I get three months off, and I make like roughly around fifty to sixty grand. Yeah, that's uh for twenty six. That's pretty good. That's great. It's a lot better than. I mean, I know people that are doing better that have, have like degrees and shit like that. But I didn't go to. I, I got a high school diploma and I'm in. I'm going to school at the Carpenters Union right now. Other than that, I don't have no college, nothing. So, it's. It, yeah. I, I'm making what people went to school f for, for like f three, four years for. Yeah, I uh, I might go into trade school because I hear college is a bit of a scam right now, but. Yeah, fuck college. I wouldn't. I mean, it the, the, it depends on how you want to look at it. Like, right. I, I can. I, I'm sure your dad probably said this too. But like, you can use your brain and go to school and make money, or you can use your body and go work in like a union. So like, you're you're gonna fuck your like, so you're gonna destroy your body in the long run doing what I'm doing. But I'm making. I didn't have to go to school. I don't. I'm not in debt. I don't owe, owe anybody money. Like, th there's ups and downs to it. And if I were if I work what I'm doing right now, if I work for ten years, I could retire. Yeah, but you want to start a family though? Um, that yeah, I do, but that's something that a little bit, a little bit more down the road for me on that on that part. That's fair. Because I know a bunch of people that have kids right now and they're struggling, and it's it's not something I want to get into. Yeah. I, I'd rather have a yeah. kid. I'd rather have a kid when I'm when I'm set and I'm financially stable and I'm comfortable to bring them into the world than rather than bring them into the world and live check by check and and have disputes with my baby mama and shit like that. Nah, I'm good on that. Yeah, that's what uh, that's what I want to do. I, I want to take. Uh, I want to have a family. That's my dream. But I'm not gonna do it like uh, you know, irresponsible. No, that's smart for for being 15 and you saying that. I, I, that says a lot about maturity. Like, you sound pretty mature for who you are. 
Yeah, I mean... Most kids your age just want to fuck bitches and party and smoke and drink and... Yeah, well, that's exactly what they do. I mean, uh, I go to a private all boys So, like, there's a ton of shit happens, and everyone's just, like, fucking with my girls and stuff. There's been a couple pregnancy stories from guys I know. Oh, I believe that. And, yeah, but, uh, I don't... I don't even, I can't drink or smoke. I mean, I have buddies, I have a dude that almost he an acid tablet in my chicken packet. He was gonna, he pulled it out of his wallet. Like, the people I know are kind of fucked up. Go behind your back and drug you? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, well, no, it was like a joke. <laughs> well, not that. But I can't because I, uh... I have such shitty genetics that it's like, if I drink at all, it'll just like turn my body into a fat piece of shit. Oh, so you're a big boy. No, I, uh, I, uh, do, I do fighting, so it's like I don't really want to get too big and stuff. Oh, I see. What do you plan on doing? Going to like the UFC or something or boxing? No, I'm not that good, but right now I do kickboxing and jiu-jitsu. So it's like, you know, I gotta pick and choose what I do when I do it. Yeah, no, that's pretty. That's pretty dope. I respect that. It's cool as shit. Yeah, I mean, I'm not doing it right now because I got kicked out of. Well, I didn't get kicked out of, but like, my coach said I can't spar anymore because I uh, got pretty fucked up last time I sparred. Like, I almost got knocked out. Mm. I haven't been able to make practices with the fighting, so it's like, so I'm just doing jujitsu right now. But I think I might be able to start making practices. Damn, that's pretty dope. So, like, it seems like you have, like, seems like you're torn between a couple different career paths and what you want to do with your life, but you're still young. You'll figure it out. Yeah, I'll figure it out, but I'm, I've, actually, I've never been in a relationship before, so it's kind of, it's, it's easy for me to uh, just work and stuff and put my head down and do that. And the, trust me, there's nothing wrong with that at all. Don't Don't let anybody discourage you away from that. There's absolutely nothing wrong with that. The house on a truck. Oh, I got more repair kits. Here, do you want to read the magazines? Because this is going to be like your main server. Uh. You can take these if you like. Otherwise, I'll read them. I mean, if you're gonna play, I got, if you're gonna hop on the server with me, I gotta then take them and read them. I will, but I can't hop on as a. Uh, please. Did you, uh, so your, your profile picture is out there that, um, have you finished the God of War game? Oh, yeah, I love the God of War games. They're, they're one of my favorite series. I have a friend that I play baseball with. He, uh, he uh, had all of the games, like from PS3 and stuff. Yeah, the, the Greek trilogy was better in my opinion than the Norse saga, but because they they could have spread it out into three games, but Corey, the, there's there was two directors from the game. Corey Barlog was a, the director of the first one, meaning like the first new trilogy of the Norse saga, and then I forgot the other guy's name, but it switched directors and. Their original plan was that they wanted to stretch it out into a trilogy and make three games for the series, but they didn't end up doing that. And then they made it into two. So it kind of got... It felt like it kind of got rushed a little bit, the second game, but the first game was amazing. Yeah, that's what I hear. I hear, like, uh, God of War is a, uh, is a 10 out of 10, and Ragnarok is a 9 out of 10. I would agree with that. Have you finished Valhalla? Yep. I don't know. I, I couldn't finish God of War. I actually started with Ragnarok because it was free at the time for me. Or I got it for free with my PlayStation. So I'm like halfway through it. But I haven't played it all because I just... I, I don't know. I just get bored. And I just struggle. You know, I die like 10 times. Hmm. Yeah, it is kind of a challenging game. It's more... It's, it's kind of like a... Like a Dark Souls kind of game. That's like a, a good way I would describe it. Um, I mean, yeah. 
And if you haven't played the the, the first three games, they're a lot different than than the last two. The last two are like a first per not first person, like a third person. Like you can roam around and shit like that. The first three are kind of like arcade style, like. Right, like back how they were when they came out, you know. Right. I uh. My first ever console was my PS5, and I got it last January. But I've I haven't had a head start on gaming too much. Besides, like, today, I don't know the games and whatever, but, like, I tried playing Bloodborne, and I didn't like it. I, um, I, I actually do enjoy Joy to Trip and Human. I like the game a lot. That was a good game, yeah. I haven't finished it though, like, I mean, I, I also pre-ordered Silent Hill 2, the remake, and I finished the Silent Hill, the last left. It was a really quick game, though. Mm. I mean, if you think about it. So if you, if you like Silent Hill, I, I, I'd i recommend you go play uh, Metal Gear Solid. You'd probably like that. That's a really good game. With, uh, with Solid Snake? Yeah. I would try it. Damn, you started, you started playing games when you were 15? That's crazy, bro. Like, uh, nine months ago, whatever, whatever last January was. that just something that you never wanted to do, or your parents never, like, bought you a system or something, or...? I mean, I never really pushed for it. And also, it was just my parents were kind of strict when I was younger. I couldn't even play Fortnite, like... Mm. I started playing Fortnite when I was 14. I mean, I could have played earlier, but I just stopped caring. But, like, back when Fortnite was out... There was a ton of shit about how it was like super addicting and like, whatever, and how it was bad for you. Hmm. Now my parents don't care too much because it's like I can make my decisions better. Yeah. Huh. Well, for someone your age, I honestly, I'll, I'll give it to you, man. You seem pretty, pretty damn smart for someone your age. Yeah, but I, uh, I, I, uh, I'm in AP U.S. history right now. Which sounds really fun, or like really smart, but I'm so bad at it, dude. I think I just bombed my last test. <laughs> I like to, uh, think if I ever fail a test or whatever, like, walk out, I can marine it out. If I need to. Yeah. Just become a marine if I have to. Damn, man. That, it's crazy to hear other people's stories and shit like that. I've been playing video games since I was, like, fucking... <laughs> as long as I can remember, since I was, like, three years old. <laughs> Dude, that's, uh... That's insane. I've never... I, I, it's just never been a thing. Like, I had a Wii U, but, you know, you can only do so much with that. It's not like a, it's not like a real console. Yeah, I would agree. Only Nintendo based, yeah. yeah. So, yeah, I had a Wii, Wii U, though, was, that was a good time, dude. I, I had some... My parents never let me buy, like, the online membership or whatever it was, so I was just playing me and my brother. Ah, uh, okay. What is it, your older brother or your younger brother? Younger brother. Hmm. Suffered, suffered an abrasion. I got caught up. Oh, buddy. Oh, I, my pipe shotgun quality is now quality too. Hmm. Do you want to try and do some missions today or no? Uh, yeah, we can. Let's finish right in this house and then we'll go back to the uh, the guy and do some missions. Oh, I didn't even know you could actually, like, repair shit like that. I thought it was only stuff that you could build. You know your left, uh, your left trigger? You can do more powerful slings with weapons and stuff. If you oh! Know. Wow! I didn't know that. 
it takes more uh stamina whatever yes stamina damn that's crazy bro i've been playing the game the whole time using the light attacks <laughs> <laughs> But with an axe, it repairs stuff, so just, um, keep that in mind. Oh, I'm cooked. I'm cooked. Nope. <laughs> oh, I forgot I had a shotgun, but I just don't got any ammo left. Yeah, I don't have any more ammo either. I gave you all the ammo that I had. I got one shot left. It was funny, the first mission I did for that, the trades dude, he, um, he gave me that shotgun. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I, I had a choice between a shotgun, a pistol, and a automatic rifle, and I only had ammo for the shotgun, so I was like, I'll just take the shotgun. An automatic rifle? Yeah. Like a like the rifle you have now, or like, did it say automatic? I think it was an automatic pipe rifle. Oh, I know what that is, yeah, yeah, yeah. The, the machine gun type, yeah, I know what that is, yeah, yeah. You just need hella, uh, pipe rifle ammo. It, they use the same ammo. Hmm, okay. Oh, I have health. You got a zombie on you? Nah, I'm good. Oh, you died. Oh, shit. No, I have three health. Mm, okay. I was just sitting out there. Oh, I can I kill these guys. Oh, item needs repair. Ah. Especially if this spear is used What? To, um, have I walked around the corner, and as he was getting up, he wasn't even swinging, but I, like, walked into him, and he killed me. That's crazy. Alright, I'll tell you what, he's dead now. I'll wait for you, though. But... Oh, there's a, there's an ammo pile, but I'm not gonna search it. I'll let you get it. Sounds good to me. Dude, I like I was talking about trying to be healthy and shit, but I'm eating a whole ice thing with Doritos. <laughs> That's good. I like Doritos. Uh, Sunday's the off day. What do you do? You work. You have like a, a strict diet and you work out a lot or something? I mean, just try and eat healthy, you know? Nah, I respect that. That's cool. Me, personally, I can eat whatever I want and I won't gain a pound, which is a blessing. <laughs> I'm a skinny guy. That's awesome. Here, I got these for you. Oh, shoot, sweet, thank you. Oh, I found all the good loot. Oh, shit. Oh, no. He got you? Oh no. I was at five health. I like the diversity of this game too. Like I go into the buildings and not every building's the same. Like I that's what I thought it was gonna be like and it's not like that. I like this. Yeah, I don't know how they got that to work, but there's tons of different biomes too, you know. Oh, this is the only biome that I've been in. There's a, I know for a fact that there's a winter one, there's a, uh, in the wind, you know that there's a winter effect too, right? Like if you get too cold at night or whatever, or if you don't have armor on, you're gonna freeze. That's pretty sick. This game like actually is super well made. I played this game before it was updated. Cause it, 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 no, it's been on PlayStation, but it looked completely different. Here you can get after all that. Sweet. 
five bullets, nice. What's this? Uh, you can take whatever's in there. What's this? Tools digest? Did we raid this place out? Yes. I'm pretty sure everything's done. We can go do some missions now if you want. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. There's a, there's a plane coming by. I think that's the care drop, or the airdrop. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Those are the, uh, the things, the, uh, care packages or whatever. I've got to go outside to see it, damn it. Ah! Where is it? Where'd they go? Oh, it's on the map. You see on the little thing up there how it's... Oh, uh, the, the old, or I said old, the gold crate? Yeah, huh. It's probably going to be some bullshit in there. Yeah, I know. This will be the you first know, one. There's, uh, you can make a, you can make cars in this game and stuff like that. There's like dead ass, like full Yeah, I do know that. This is kind of like a, I would describe this as like a, like a very well done zombies Minecraft, which is pretty much what Dude, it is. That's exactly what I say. I'm like, it's like Minecraft, but it's just strictly zombies. This is like, this is what, when, when you first started playing Minecraft, this is what you wanted out of Minecraft, was this. Like... <laughs> yeah, it's exactly. This is how it felt playing out Pocket Edition seven years ago. This game is much more... It's just awesome. I don't know how, how to code stuff like this. And I like how it's open world, you know? It's infinitely big. Yeah. That is pretty damn cool. Do we have the same crate? Are you by me? I oh no, you're way far away from me. We must be going in the opposite direction. No, I think, I think yours is the same. I'm, uh, I just stopped running. I was falling and I just stopped running for a second because I'm eating some candy. Candy and... Um, the nerds gummy clusters. Oh, oh, dude, those are so good. They're they are so good. They're they're like those are like scary addicting to eat. Like, I know. Back when I when I used to eat those, dude, they, that was like a, a really good <laughs> this thing to eat. That's honestly probably one of the best candies I've ever had, besides chocolate. Those are like top, top tier. Yeah. I like Hershey's the most. There's not really, like, Hershey's is just, you can, you always can go right with it. Right. Especially, like, in the little individual package thing. That, that's what I mean for the nerds when we clusters. Uh -huh. mm. First aid kit, claw hammer, and then a crafting skills box. Which just gives you a ton of magazines, the time that you have. I want to get that claw hammer though, because I think this would be good for a. Uh, maybe as a weapon. Whoa! Did you run past that little underground ditch thing? I did, yeah. You want to get after that? Yeah, I'm gonna. I, I'll wait for you. I'm gonna come towards you. So, I want to see what the care yeah, package looks like. I'm going towards. Oh, you haven't found it yet? No, I, I ran by it, but it was past that, so I, I'm lost right now. Hmm. So it should be. Oh, all right. Here, take this. Uh, do not take this. I'm just dropping stuff. Was this was this stuff in that care package? Yeah, the thing that I dropped you, yeah. So that's like a box. It holds a bunch of magazines in it. Oh, I see. Okay. So those are really good if you find those, cause it, it's not just for books. It could be for um, weapons. It could be for mods. Yeah, I just got a medical tier one, and then there's uh, what's this one? Handgun. Nice. Wait, what kind of handgun? Pistol. Pipe pistol quality four unlocked. Nice. I think after you get to quality four, then you unlock like a new gun. Uh. I'm not, I hate to break it to you, but no, nah, that's not true. Oh, that's not? No, I, uh, I think my pipe rifles are like quality five and stuff, and I can't, you have to, this game is really confusing on how to craft and stuff, but you have to get a certain magazine, like, and then read it 75 times, and that's how you get it. Hmm. 
Okay. Um, it's really, yeah, that's the hardest part. It's really hard to get new weapons without finding them. So if you find them, you pretty much just make sure you repair them and don't lose them. Because yeah, if you do, you're exactly, fucked. <laughs> yeah, cause you can't, just because you find it doesn't mean you can craft it. You actually have to, so yeah, never drop like a pistol or a hunting rifle. That's what you use those uh, repair kits for, for those more advanced things. Ah, uh, okay, okay. I've never seen anything like this. Uh, yeah, I do. I have four. Just give me, uh, Here, you nah, can you take can it. it. No, you can I take it. I don't even got a shot. shotgun. You're the shotgun oh. man, nah. Let's go. Wait, hold up. I'm gonna use the bathroom real quick. I was. Oh, oh yeah. shit. Yeah. Never mind. Three zombies coming in. Boom. Oh shoot, they're like coming from... Where's this one coming from? Wow. Oh dude, this climb is kind of tough. Eat that. <laughs> Alright, wait. Let's find a safe place so I can piss. Uh, uh, that's, actually, that's funny. I gotta piss too. So if we die, we die together. That's fair. I'll, right. I'll be right back. Shoot, I'm overcumbered. Hmm. Yo, I'm back. Yeah, I'm here. Wait, yo, did you still need that glue? I've got glue. Nah, nah, nah. It was just to create the pipe pistols. Oh, shoot. And food. Here, there's a magazine in here. What are? Do you know what those? Like, if you open up your inventory and you see the the gray squares, what are those bottom, like, four gray squares for? That's for crafting. The stuff's gonna be there when you're crafting stuff, for repairing stuff. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Do you know what the uh, the darker boxes are? Yeah, that's I, I have a couple of them unlocked. That's like if you're over encumbered. Right, yeah, yeah, yeah. See, there's mods that you can equip that uh you put onto your arm when it gets right in. Yeah, now this game is oh. dope. They got caves and stuff in here, that's sick. 
and everything's named and rated differently, you know? I like, like that. You could be like at the Johnson's house, and then you could be at like James Cornfield. Right, just because you raid the one house that was easy doesn't mean the next house you go into is going to be easy, too. That, that could be a real hard oh, one. No, I, I low key need this one to kill me. Oh, shoot, my bad. I was trying to. I actually don't know where I'll spawn them. I'll just live it out. Oh, there's some ammo in there. Here, come here. Yeah, there you go. Oh, nice spears. Oh, also, when you're using campfire, do not use gasoline as fuel. Use wood planks. <laughs> Does it? Last so long. 